bad and stupid sap and drunk and joy instead of broad coats, green and chips. All shit in front of the rest. Ain't nice, only headshots. But you don't miss, show me savage with your bandage. Flip a cup to whip. She don't miss. <laughs> another awesome GTA 5 glitch tutorial and this is the currently working car to car merge first things first you want to make sure that you blow up the vehicle that you want to put the mods on so whatever car you want to mod you want to go ahead and make sure you blow that sucker up another thing that's awesome about this glitch you guys is that whoever your friend is who's helping you out do this glitch they can mod their vehicle at the same time so make sure that they blow up their vehicle as well and then you want to go into the Los Santos car meet and you want to go ahead and have them go up to the interaction menu and you want to go ahead and have them go to the LS car meet and then they want to just go ahead and click the sprint race. And then of course when they click the sprint race you want to make sure that you join that sprint race. So again you guys um, requirements for this all you need is a car you want to mod and a car with some mods on it which is the car that has the mods on it, you want to make sure that that's the car that you drive into the Los Santos car meet with. So as you can see here, this is the car I want to take the mods from, and the vehicle that I want to mod is already blown up. So you don't want to repair it or nothing or call Mars Mutual, you just want to blow it up and then enter the LS car meet. Now, we're going to go ahead and let the sprint race start up. We're not going to do anything until it gets started up. So we we'll are go ahead and let it count down, three, two, one, go. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, and then you want to go ahead and search up Anawak 2P4 and you want to join his session. Now, when you go get that first alert, what you're going to want to do is accept it. But when we get the second alert, you want to decline it. Then we want to hit the interaction button and go down to kill yourself and take the easy way out. Okay, so when we respawn, now what we want to do is open up our phone and we're going to call Morris Mutual because remember that car that we blew up that we want to mod? <laughs> well, this is where that part comes in. So we're going to go to the garage that it is and we're going to hover over that vehicle. Then we're going to head to the closest body of water, which I'm using the Ellis River because it is the closest. And then we're just going to simply drive into the water. So we're going to jump right off there. As soon as our screen goes gray, we're spamming X. And when we spam X, we're going to respawn and we should be inside of that vehicle with the mods from that previous vehicle on it, which we do. Look how awesome that car turned out, you guys. Doesn't it look good? <laughs> awesome. Now, in order to get out of the sprint race, all, you're, all you want to do is we're going to press the pause button. And you want to make sure that you previously had put all the jobs on your screen. And then you want to go up to those jobs that are showing. And you're just going to go ahead and start it up. So for the first alert, when you do start it, it's going to say unable to connect. But that's fine. Just back out and then, or after you, it'll back you out. Then go ahead and just start it up again. Load into it and back out. And you'll see the mods are still there. But you still want to drive to Los Santos Customs and you want to change one thing on the vehicle so it saves. Anyways, you guys, um, that's it for this video. If you liked it, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Thanks for all the love, you guys. Until next time, you guys, this has been Barco Batty with another awesome GTA 5 glitch tutorial. Until next time, you guys, stay lit. Alright, this is it. I know. Flip a cup to whip.
you don't miss. <laughs>